Today we'll be looking at tens and ones in a block base. These are called block bases. And we're going to count how many are in the first block. So here we go. Count with me. Ready? Let's go. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. So we have ten in we have ten in the first block. Okay. So as we can see, if we have 10 in the first block, the second block has to have 10 as well. They are exactly the same size. Look at them very carefully. They are exactly the same size. So we have 10, and then we have another 10, and then we have another 10. So let's get our fingers out. Let's count in 10s. 10. Remember, we're counting 10 three times. 10. 20, 30. Well done. So we have got three tens, and up here it's already saying three tens. So well done. You've done really well. So we have three tens. Let's now look at the units. What color should we use? Oh, let's try blue. Okay, so now we're going to count the single blocks. These are called ones. These are called ones. Yes, that's correct. Let's count them. Are you ready? Count with me. One, two, three, four, five. How many ones do we have? Five ones. Well done. You are absolutely correct. And here we have five ones written there already. And then when you put these two numbers together, we make 35. That is exactly what we're going to do in the next number. We are going to put them together and make 35s. However, you know 3 tens equals 30. So you can count in tens three times. 10, 20, 30. And then we know we have five units, five ones. So we count the ones. 31, 32, 33, 34, 35. Well done. Let's look at the next one. So we know these already add up to 10 because we have counted it in the first round. In the first question, we have counted it. So we're going to highlight this. Let's get cracking. So are you ready? We are going to count in tens. Remember, because this is a 10 base. There's 10 blocks in this big, in this big long stick. That is 10, 20, 30, 40. How many do we have? You are right. We have four tens, which is 40. So here it's asking us how many tens do we have? We have four tens. And what does four tens make? Yes, you are right. Four tens make 40. 10 at 10 at 10 at 10 make 40. I'm going to write 40 down here for you so that we remember that. Right, shall we use another pencil? Let's use green this time. Right. So we have four tens. Let's see how many ones do we have. One, two. We have two. We have two ones. Forty add two equals forty-two. How many ones do we have? The first one's telling us it's asking us how many tens we have. One ten, two ten, three tens, four tens. The second box is asking us how many ones we have. One, one, and two ones. So we have two ones. Four tens and two ones. How are we going to write that down? What we do here is we just 
put these two together, as they are now good friends. Forty-two. Right, let's look at the next one. And now that you know how to count in your tens, and you're very good at that, let's count in our tens again. Are we ready? So, ten, twenty, thirty, forty, fifty. So we have five tens, and our answer is fifty. We have fifty. Five tens equals fifty. How many tens do we have? Five. You are right. One, two, three, four, five. We have five sticks of tens. Well done. Right. How many ones do we have? Let's count them. Let's do it together. One, two. Three, four. How many ones do we have? That's right. It is four. Well done. Fifty-four. If you look at that number, it makes fifty-four. So we're going to write the number fifty-four here. What are we going to do this time? Because you're doing really well, and we're going to carry on. We will carry on counting these until we get to the number fifty-four. So let's go for it. Ten, twenty, thirty, forty, fifty. After fifty, what we need to do is count in ones. So we're going to convert our mind and go and count in ones. Fifty, fifty-one, fifty-two. Fifty-three, fifty-four. Well done, and that's the answer we got. Right, let's look at the fourth question. Right, so let's count them in tens again. We know these are ten spades. They have ten blocks in one stick because we counted them previously to find out. Okay, let's count them again. Let's count in tens. Ten. Twenty, thirty, forty. How many tens do we have? Four tens. You are right. Let's pop down four tens here. Well done. Let's count the ones. One, two, three. How many ones do we have? Three ones. Well done. We do have three ones. Four tens and three ones makes forty-three. We write the number exactly the way it's written as a pair. So forty-three. We just drop the four and the three down to make forty-three. Right. Let's go. Let's count again. Let's count, making sure that we are able to count in tens, and then adding. The ones as well. So let's do it together. Ten, twenty, thirty, forty, forty-one, forty-two, forty-three. Fantastic! And that is what we got. Well done. You all are doing so well. Right. Let's look at the next one. How many tens do we have? We're always going to start with the tens because it's a bigger number. It just makes life easier. Okay, let's count: ten, twenty. So, how many tens do we have? Two tens. We know we have twenty blocks. However, when we talk about them in tens, there are two lots of tens in it, and you can use your fingers. We have ten fingers included in the thumbs. You can use your hands to count in tens. So you can say ten, twenty. 
Well done. Let's go to the ones. Let's count the ones block. So the ones blocks are the single blocks, and let's count them. One, two, three. How many ones do we have? Three. Well done. That is correct. Two tens and three ones. Now what we're going to do is we're going to count them from scratch, from the beginning. Let's count them. I'm going to do it in a different way now. Let's see. Ten, twenty, twenty-one, twenty-two, and twenty-three. I have illustrated it this time because you're doing so well. I have shown you that we have 10, 20, 21, 22, and 23. So how many blocks do we have? You are right. We have 23 blocks in total. Well done. You're doing so well. Okay, let's go to the next question. Let's get my little pinky out. Right, let's go and let's do the next question. How many tens do we have? Let's count the tens. 10... 20, 30, 40, 50, 50, we have 50 blocks and that is 5 tens, with 1 ten, 2 tens, 3 tens, 4 tens, 5 tens, well done, we have 5 tens here. How many ones do we have? Let's count the ones. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. We have seven ones. Let's write seven there. Fifty-seven. We have made 57. Let's just double check our answer to make sure it is 57. Let's count in tens. 10, 20, 30, 40, 50, 51, 52, 50. 53, 54, 55, 56, 57. Absolutely amazing you all are getting on really well. We have two more questions left to do. So let's do the next question. Question 6. How many tens do we have? We're going to ask ourselves every single question we're asking ourselves. How many tens do we have? Then we're going to say, how many ones do we have? Let's see how many tens we have. Ten. Twenty. We have twenty blocks. But how many tens do we have? One. Two. We have two tens. How many ones do we have? One, two, three, four. Well done, that's absolutely correct. We have four ones. Now, let's just double check our answer. And we also need to fill this part in as well, which says number. 10, 20, 21, 22, 23, 24. 24 is our answer. Two tens add four ones equals 24 blocks we have in total. Right, the last question. Let's go and complete the last question. So, how many tens do we have? 10, 20, 30. Wow, we have 30 blocks. How many tens do we have? We have one lot of 10, two lots of 10, three lots of 10s. How many tens do we have? Yes, I heard you right. Three tens. How many ones do we have? One, two, three, four, five, 
six. Yes, you are correct. We have six ones. Let's just double check that we have three tens and six ones. And our answer is 36. 10, 20, 30, 31, 32, 33, 34, 35, 36. Well done. We have 36 blocks in total. Three tens and six ones. You are absolutely correct. Well done. You have worked so hard today. Have a good break and I will see you soon.